Well, shit heels, I don't expect this to be a full-length thing, but we have a thing here tonight. It's just me and Mongo tonight, and, uh... It's the meme game. Basically, here's here's the board, right? So there's a start, a one, a two, and a three occupying each of these corners. I don't even know which one of these is the fucking goal by the instructions. I'm gonna fucking... yeah. I mean, do you know? No, I have no... For I've never seen or heard this game before in my life. I'm afraid to touch it. That's probably because it's not... <clears throat> It's not a real game. Probably some whack job just came up with it. Uh, so I've dropped I've dropped a couple fucks here. Really, only a D four. Here. Oh, you want to use that? I was literally just going to use this as my player token. It's a bit big. You can shrink it using the minus. Yeah, but I don't want to give a little fuck. Fine. Happy? Apparently not. Are you giving literally the smallest fuck you could possibly give? Hold on, let me go find the violin real quick. Yes, yeah, very funny. And also, uh, no. Not a d4. The only thing I can think of is that you want to get to one, then two, then three, maybe? I mean, I'm good with that. Here, how about this? A D8? Sure, why not? Alright. Now, we don't have to necessarily forward, backward, any what have you. Red cards get stockpiled, blue cards are immediate. You want to do that then? One, two, three. Oh, well, good luck with that. Right. Actually, actually, hold, 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 hold. This doesn't count. I have another idea. For, for this starting roll only, I'm going to use this. Hope you don't mind. Uh, I do. <laughs> Okay, I don't anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> yeah. Go. I did not expect that outcome. I'm not complaining about that outcome. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I am going to fuck off and play a blue card immediately. Uh, one moment. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Before you, before you do that, actually, the rules do say we start with a red card in each hand. You hold one? Yep. Um... Oh, this is cool. So, they got they got pretty cute with the opponent's hands. I'm going to draw mine in here. Take a good look at this. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's wonderful. But now for this blue card. <laughs> Not bad. All active red cards will be abolished. Mm. Well, utterly, no one's playing anything right now, so... Utterly accurate, Varg. And welcome. Uh, so, if I recall, red cards, you have to all play active. them before you dice. All active, yes, before you dice. That's very properly grammaticized. All active red cards will be abolished. Are these... Are these considered active in our hand? Because if they are, No, they you have to play them first. I didn't play anything. Yeah, let me see. You have to play before you roll dice. I already rolled my dice, so I can't play. 
Right. Yeah, okay. I was just thinking of the definition of uh, active here. Okay. Uh, I'll take my chances with a red and uh, properly resize my fuck. Well, who gives a fuck? Well, nobody at the moment. We're kind of just taking them in stride. Okay, well, I think I'm going to play my uh, my red card. Is that right? Yes. Uh, anchor. A player may only move one pitch per round for three rounds. Uh, one pitch as in one space, I guess? That's as best as I can understand it. Movements by cards may happen. Are you invoking that on me or yourself? Uh, you. All right. Uh, hold on. Well, fuck. I've actually just found a use for a d4 after all. So, that's set to three. Ah. Uh, okay. Well, it is your turn. Mm-hmm. You might want this then. Oh, sweet. And this is. Ooh, I get to roll again. Dice again. Well, no, you gotta use the right voice for it. Dice again! Dice again! Actually, you could draw yourself a red card by... Yeah, that's one way to do it. Uh... I'm invoking a red. Specifically this one. Pull a player next to your position. I'm going to put you right there. Are you happy? Eh, not really. And this card is now out of play. That is not a nine, Mongo. I'm going to invoke this just because uh, I don't even fucking know how it reads. 
Move a tile that's right next to you by one to three pitches. How does that even work? So, taking that to mean that, wait, does it say right next to you? I think that means that you can take this red square because it's adjacent to you and say you get a four, you can move this red square to here and that four will get you there. Or you can move it to here, and if you get a two, you've got it. For a meme game, that is an incredible amount of mental gymnastics. Yes, it is. Uh, all right. Um, I take it to mean that it also only happens for your turn because it does not say permanent. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do, since we're playing the game of loose interpretations and all that. Well, first you got to pick where you're putting it. Does the card say that? Uh, you have to, or you activate before you roll. So ah, but I activated it. I just haven't. Yeah, decided so you have on to pick it. a location now. But I haven't decided on its activation yet. I've activated it. That's the only rule in play. See, I was trying to bullshit the game as much as the game is trying to bullshit us. And this isn't going to help me in any of those directions anyway. So, uh, so fuck it. I'm just gonna do this. Oh, that's a wall of text. Oh, good God. Oh, so have you heard about uh, the great Unity stupidity? No, I haven't. Okay. Especially if anyone's in the audience, kids. Let's learn a lesson about not hiring people who have already caused the downfall of other companies. Hmm. The CEO of Unity, the software engine, yes. generally used to make video games. Yes, yes. Well, the company as a whole decided to make a uh, policy. Every time an indie game gets downloaded for the first time to a hardware device of any kind, they're going to charge the uh, developer of that game. Charge them? Yeah. For what? For using the program, I guess. And that also counts for people who are making free games as well as not free games. Well, it sounds like I'm not going to be buying from anything that involves Unity. Good luck with that. A vast majority of games are made with Unity, actually. Well, then I retire from streaming and switch to board games. So there. Yeah. Well, people are expecting that they're going to change it. Also, there's prob Oh. <laughs> this is the real kicker of it. Um, there's a list of publishers who are currently getting ready to file suits against uh, Unity. Let me just pull it up from what a friend sent me. The list is as follows. Steam. Uh -huh. Nintendo. Uh -huh. Hoyoverse. Uh -huh. Tencent. Uh -huh. Microsoft. Yep. And this one's my favorite. Lockheed Martin. Christ. Yeah, no, apparently Lockheed uses them for creating flight sims. They, they done fucked up. Yeah, yeah, they did. Yeah, they done diddly did. I... Yeah. Well, thank you. They managed to piss off so many people, and... It's actually funny, uh, earlier when EA, I forget what the game was, I think it was, it might have been Battlefront, one of the EA's titles, or no, I think it was one of the Maddens, tried to massively push through microtransactions, which backfired horribly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the CEO that was in charge of EA at the time is supposedly the same CEO of Unity right now. 
that made that decision, mm -hmm. who is known for being quoted that he wanted to charge Battlefield players for every reload. That's just dumb. That may have been taken out of context. I really hope not that he's that stupid that he said that honestly. Mm. I really hope that was a joke on his part. Mm. Because... Trying to fathom someone that blatantly stupid and sadistic. Mm. But the other thing is that's really going to get him in hot water. Mm -hmm. He sold like two thousand shares of dice or not that, of Unity the day before this pro or this uh, policy was announced. That's that's insider trading. I know. So maybe it's actually very likely that he is that stupid that he would say something like that. Either way, the fact that he's gotten one of the highest contracted military funded organizations. Someone who I'm pretty sure the CEO could literally kill an entire building worth of people and go have photos of him being best friends with Epstein... And no one would still be able to touch him. He managed to piss that person off. Well, there's going to be some bombs going off in the sky. And in his general vicinity in the near future. Anyway, thank you. For I hope that. so. Well, thank you for the news update. Here, I'm going to make your life a living hell for a while. Anchor. Mm. And blue. All active red. <laughs> You know what's funny, though? What? I kind of want to... I only want to go three spaces. Steal the steps of a player of your choice right after he diced. Man, this grammar is just giving me life. So, in which case, that also means you go back. And now I shall go forward. Since I am stealing your dice. You may re-roll. But first, the blue card. And you realize... You realize you also just handed me another red card. Potentially, you still have to roll. Oh, I know. But I get to draw a red card. Well, no, it, you didn't move to that space. Or you didn't land on that space. You were sent back. Let me look. If a player hits a red square on the board, it says nothing about whether I actually... I would argue there. you didn't hit that square. I would argue I did, based on your forced move of me. And it put me there. I would argue with my roll of eight, and you're not one, that you did not. There's only one way to settle this. For the interpretation that plays... Well, fine, then this gets discarded. Eh, damn. I, I would not have been likely to use it anyway. Well, it's your re-roll, and then it's your turn again. So, technically speaking, by the basis of what this describes, you get two turns in a row. Uh-huh. Whoops, uh, wrong key. This is the key I want. Or right, hold on. There we go. Get the physics right. We. Hmm. Seven, eight. A 
Oh, that is bullshit. Now for my other turn. Here, have a uh, have fun getting to uh, the one space this way. Slide. A player does not need to dice. He can only move forward or backward and can only be stopped by a wall, tile, or another player. As long as the card gets eliminated by specific other cards. Roughly translated... So no matter what, I no longer roll. Nope. You, uh... Until you I get a card that gets rid of that. Yep. So you slide all the way in whatever direction you slide in. Actually, sorry. That was... That was hasty. I'm just gonna keep it. I mean, sure, but... One. Uh, actually, you have to hit the goal on point. Two, three, four, five... No, sorry. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I slide to the left. Also, for a game that's supposed to be based on memes, this isn't very mean. Hmm. Or at least it's mostly precursor shit. One, two. <clears throat> Slide to the right. Dice and move a player of your choice in any direction you want. doesn't say you can't self. Says any player I want. Oh! Oh, I get it now. So at the start of the game, we were supposed to roll for whichever goal. One through three. I guess I would explain the D4, but that's not as much fun. Um... So, discard and draw again? Let me think about this a sec. How can we make this fun? Also, it doesn't stay to roll the dice for the... I say roll the d4 and make that an extra move. Use this strategically because of your situation. an odd higher than a one. Fucking Christ a lot. Okay, whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to bump you over to here. Is that how that works? Oh, uh, yeah. It, it is. doesn't say. Well, it does. It says you can bump out players. But then what's the interpretation? Like, what are the mechanics behind that? Only thing I can understand is either I bump you into another direction or I bump you back to start. Hmm. 
but then can you pass another player in your move? See, here's the thing. Now it's going to start giving me odds because I need an even to get over there. Or not. I'm just going to move past you right there. One. So we're keeping to our interpretation? Yeah. Well, I see no reason not to just bump you off like that. One, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, eight. Hmm. Why don't you come on back down? And he slides to the left. All right, let's use this. Here, have a look, see. Okay, that was kind of fucky looking. Hmm? It like slowed down Matrix style as it went to eight and then landed. Here, fine. Watch me do it again, this time the natural way. And actually have it land on an 8. There, see? Yeah, close enough, but... So my understanding is now you can bypass uh, black squares. Yep. As long as you don't land on them. Yep. Swap the places of you and a player of your choice. <sighs> well, this, it's finally come in handy. Nope, 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 nope. See, it doesn't make any sense that it says that you have to play a red card before you roll. Yeah, but then there are a lot of games out there that say that there's a... there are exception cards out there. In which direction do you fuck me off? That direction? I am Jack fuck me off. My god damn it, you can't get to the two with that card in play. Yes, but I could have immediately guaranteed myself a red this turn. Oops.
You could still Did take. that actually land? Okay, because that just, like, lagged a whole bunch. All that bitching and complaining about not getting a red card, you could have taken one just now. Yeah, if I went backwards. You gotta look forward to the future. Oh, I am looking forward to the future. Here, read this. Oh, fuck it, you. You just gave me the worst version of the other card. <laughs> well, actually, well, arguably, as, it's the better version. As far as I can tell, it just means you can't turn mid-move. Yeah, I know. Well, I couldn't turn with the other card. But I kept going until I hit a black tile. Uh, did you just draw from the discard? You did. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I'm like, what was I seeing? You know what? I'm not rolling for obvious reasons. Um, it doesn't say you can't stack reds, but that seems overpowered to me. Uh, it says somewhere, um, before you dice in just one card per turn. Yeah, but then, if someone's already got a red against them, is there a rule against having a second? No. I think that's too so much. So you want to compound ability cards on me? Actually, I think that's too much. I no, do it, I dare you. Do no you. balls. Well, it's not that, it's... You got no this. balls. All you are is a shaft. Okay, fine, here. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, where's that D4? Here, I'm going to do this. I'm going to clone the D4. And I'm effectively going to stay put, and we're going to get another blue. Don't forget to turn the, uh, yeah, that. That was not happy. I just realized my grand error. Let me see if I can get a blue that'll reverse it. Place a tile on the board right next to you or move a tile. Which by one to three pitches. I just realized this sack of tiles, but what does it mean? Oh, by a special blue card it is possible to place tiles on the board. Tile, these tiles have to be seen as walls and so can't be jumped. For that reason, you may not block away totally or trap someone. If there's no other way for a player, a tile of the player's choice may be removed. Okay, so that is actually a thing. 
Okay, so we've just been stupid. Uh, where do you want to place that tile? Where do I want to place it? Here. <laughs> At the start? Sure. Then you spawn right in a fucking wall. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to put it over here. Yeah, you'd still have to place it one to three within you and... Or... Fine. Yeah, no, you have to place it either next to you or within one to three spaces. Fine, here. And that's out of play. One, two, three, four, five. Do I look like I'm fucking laughing? Wait, you have that other card. Yeah, I know. So, so why are you rolling? One, two, three, four, five, six, no. One, two, three, four, five. Well, actually, six. that makes sense because an odd. One, two, three, four, five, six. No matter what, I'm ending up in the same king spot. I'm going to do the stealings. One, two, three, four, five, six. Which is going to grant you two rolls because of how that card is read. But first... Okay. Before you do that, I feel we should resolve the red card first. Uh, hold on, just a... Yeah, yeah, sure, whatever. One, two, three. So... Well, now there's another blue I'll draw card. this card, but resolve your card first. Okay, in that case, I will bump you to this red, which means you now draw red. God damn it. Well, no, and I what is this blue trigger? Well, actually, actually, no, I don't. Not according to the dice roll that decided that. Which means this is no good either. Every player meets at the throne number. Okay. Except for the goal. So, right now, since our goal is two, it That's... can only be... It can only be one, three, or four. Please not a four, please not a four, please not. Oh, thank God. Are we about to... And then it's my turn again. Yeah. We ain't got no steering on this ship! one the most out of anyone. I'm gonna go piss that off real quick. BRB. Uh, 
Okay, folks, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go to the bathroom as well, then. Up yours, Alpha. shit am I going to have to endure?
Okay, I'm back. That is the big holy fuck. So, I forgot to mention, but I made you proud today. Oh, I guess so. In a way you didn't realize. Mm. So I'm playing Legend of uh, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah. And I'm doing a quest line that involves a young, impressionable child who's going through his I can do anything phase. Why is everyone holding me back? And so we hear a voice call out from the heavens as part of a cutscene. Uh-huh. And I just make the mention that the character I just referred to is going through puberty. Uh-huh. On cue, in a way that I could not have possibly predicted, the voice from the heavens proceeds to say, Come. That's... That's it? I mean, there was more to it, but there's no way I could have predicted that he would have told him that he needed to jizz. In a Zelda game. Right, on that note, I'm going to grab my donuts real quick. They're like five feet from me. Oh, so it's going to take you eight hours. Got it. Okay, I have them. Which I guess under strict interpretation could be me, but I suspect nothing says you don't have to. Here. Uh, can you do that? Dice. Again. I can't turn. Dice again and move a player of your choice in the direction of the goal. That does absolutely nothing for me. Because it's absurd, in case you were wondering. Yeah, well, actually, before you move, I'm gonna play this. can't go anywhere, so it's your turn to re-roll. Why aren't you moving? Because I had an eight. I see where you're I see where you're going with that. Really? Well, take it. I've only got one, grab it.
Oh good, it is a good cream. So, I'm gonna help myself out here, okay. and I'm gonna play this on myself, for obvious reasons. Okay. And either I get to... Either I get to keep this going, and it works out for me well, or we're gonna get a blue card that gets rid of it, and I'll have I'll go back to being normal again. You, normal. What are you drinking? Okay, a lot of these songs sound like things I swear I've heard from popular movies. It's the children's list. Okay, so get a hold of your uh, D4 you've got there. Because we're playing a battle royale. got one too. So nothing changes. Hmm. My fuck is coming for you. I'll be damned. Two red cards the code.
One, two, three, four, five, six. Out of my way, you. What the fuck, man? God, I hate that song. Me too. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I blame whatever commercial has that song going. I hate it for that reason. Um, actually, it was the tabletop sim theme song. As in, right out of the menu. What are the five? Oh. Wow. I don't wish to do that. Well, you're doing it anyway. I warn you now, two of mine suck. And you grab one of the ones that suck. I'm using it now. Uh, what are you doing? Read that. Oh, eliminates active red cards. Yeah! Whatever, I'm using it. Seems that the speech center of the brain is no longer fully operational. Hey, is that towards the dice or towards the goal, though? Technically, yes. It's one space closer on one of the two axes. Actually, you don't get a red card anyway, so here. So now all you need to do is roll it. Can you farm blue cards that way? One, two, three, four. Yeah, I guess you could. Oh, no! Well, if you roll a three, that's instant victory. No, except for the goal. I just can't roll a four. If I blot that card out right now... Well, not that it matters. That's the worst landing you could have made. Did I just... Delete the dice and the iPod? Yes. You know why? Oh, now we're going 20s? You know why? Because it's time. And we're even anyway, so... Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen.
11. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Did you just try to cross a diagonal threshold? No. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I keep getting that at the best of times. It's actually kind of impressive at this point. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, 11, 12, 13, for... 14, 15. Okay, I was about to say you're going for 15. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Ah! Uh, I know full well. Well, no. I know what I just did. You want to know the stupid part of the whole thing? What? There's a V two. Why is there a V two? What the hell is going on here? Well, the decks look pretty similar anyway. Here, feel free to search this and take a look. Why can I not... Oh, I can't because you're doing it, I think. Do what? I can't actually look at the cards. Oh, here, try it. Or interact with them. Yeah, you can't do it if someone else is doing it. Mm. Enter hell. That's probably this. Hell's rules. Enter hell and bring a friend. Choose a player and force him to play a random red card that you picked from his hand. All cards like a player of your choice will be played on you by default. Of course they got the Tobey Maguire one. I don't have any desire. I hear they make a little blue pill for that. Yeah, well, not tonight. I need to sleep. No, you're not. You need to go find a donut. One with a little bit of chocolate frosting. I've got one. I'm not going to invoke it yet. <clears throat> what I am going to do, however, is kill the show and go to bed. I wanted to do well, something. I wanted to do something beforehand, so that's why we still did it, despite the fact that neither blue nor silver is around tonight. Well, I'm sure one of these days they'll actually join us again. Yeah, just life. But yeah, life. Eh. Uh, Varg, thank you for joining us, and uh, for all you other fuck knobs out there. Uh, We're sorry that it's a short stream. You may be sorry, I'm not. Well, it just means I have more Breath of the Wild to go beat before Lies of P comes out. Yeah, have or fun. Or not Breath of the Wild, uh, Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, have fun. Well, be seeing y'all. Good night. Mongo is only pawning.